Hello, my name is Hidden Renfrey. I made this video to talk about why I like BASIC. If some of you have been following my channel, I mentioned numerous times that I like the BASIC programming language. Especially if I'm making games. BASIC stands for Beginner's All-Purpose Symbolic Instruction Code. Yes, rather than C++, Python, Java, JavaScript, and all the other more famous languages for making games, unless it's Raylib, I still prefer either basic or basic style languages such as App Game Kit, Cerberus X, Monkey X, Free Basic, Blitz Basic, and those kind of languages for making games. Now the reason that I like basic style languages is because number one, I'm old school. The basic languages has been around for a while and it was used to make games for the old Atari, the Commodore 64, Texas Instruments, old IBM computers, and Microsoft started out with it. Just working in BASIC for me is nostalgia. To me, BASIC feels like a game programming language. I remember seeing BASIC on the front of my old Atari games. I remember the green screen Apple computers I remember the Texas Instrument computers with a very thick book that had basic code in them to where if you type the basic code out, instead of CDs, DVDs, cartridges, or downloads, sometimes that was the way that you get your game up and running. I also remember being at Pizza Hut back then and seeing the basic programming language written as big as day on some arcade games and that vision stuck with me. Those who grew up with BASIC knows what I'm talking about. Now many would call BASIC an outdated language, but a programming language is a programming language. You can't lose learning any function of programming language and BASIC is still a great language to learn. BASIC is where a lot of programs got started. A person could learn their programming fundamentals with BASIC and Actually, the B in BASIC stands for beginners, and BASIC was intended for beginners to get into programming back then. The BASIC language is especially good for kids, as a lot of people started with BASIC as a kid. In fact, with BASIC language, I took a couple of days and taught my niece and a few girls Blitz BASIC, and they could pick it up immediately because BASIC has such an easy syntax is flexible and beginner friendly and basic can become as advanced as you want it to be there are game programming basic languages and there is free basic where which is an all-purpose language that you could do some incredible things with i myself like basic because i get to make what i want without having to deal with brackets indentations and punctuations in c plus plus and all those other bracket based languages if you miss one very very little bracket or semicolon your whole program won't work in python if your code is not indented properly your whole program won't work either the bracket and indentation languages are good but worrying about the latter i admit that stuff can be annoying sometimes now of course there are benefits to why c sharp python etc are the way they are the above programming languages teaches good habits that's for sure in fact in programming you should indent and line up your code so that it makes sense and i realized that ides come with debugging functions built in for programming languages like c sharp java javascript and they tell you where your mistakes are and python c sharp java javascript and the are very easy languages too and they're all good languages and this is not to discourage anyone from starting with python c sharp java javascript as the first language because they are excellent and they teach you to be very careful don't be afraid of any programming language what i'm saying is just my opinion the key is to pick a tool set that you like go with it and stick with it and become a master in it but then that's what i did like basic well i don't consider myself a master in it but it has definitely gave me a good direction when it comes to making games and programming. I wish that BASIC was a little more mainstream language next to C-sharp, Python, Java, 
and JavaScript, C++, and the rest. Well, I guess some groups are in the process of preserving BASIC and, for example, the game creators with App Game Kit uses BASIC and the creators of Monkey X and Service X does too. They like BASIC style languages for the same reason I do. But either way, if you want to learn programming, BASIC will get you to wherever you want to go. You could use BASIC to learn the fundamentals of programming. And if you want to, you can always migrate to other languages such as C++, Python, Java, JavaScript, C Sharp, and other functional languages. It's literally all of the same stuff. Programming is programming. And the skills are transferable. In either language, you'll still be dealing with functions, variables, if statements, classes, and or types. It's all logic and the whole nine yards. Thus, if you could program in BASIC, you could go to any of the other languages and pick them up in literally one minute. You could take those skills and apply them to, let's say, web development, a field where there's lots of jobs. I wish one day the industry would recognize BASIC as a decent language. I wish to see BASIC come back, especially for anybody to get into. Again, BASIC is where I started at, and if anybody masters BASIC, you will be a full-fledged programmer for sure. And then the programmer world could be at your feet. So that's what I think. Until next time. Thanks. Bye. Dude.